Swifties at Super Bowl Parade are going to be disappointed. Taylor Swift is going back to work. The pop superstar will not be at the Chiefs Parade in Connors City on Wednesday, as according to reports, she is flying back to Australia for the resumption of her era's tour. There was speculation that there could be time for Swift to attend the parade and still make it to Melbourne in time for the first show, which is 6 p.m. Friday night there. The parade begins at noon in Kansas City and Melbourne is 17 hours ahead, which would have made for a dicey commute. Taylor Swift is officially on her way here, Melbourne TV station 10 News first reported on Tuesday, as first noted by KC.com. A private jet, believed to be carrying Swift, departed Lax earlier this morning en route to Hawaii, with flight logs showing the plane is due to land in Melbourne shortly after midnight tonight. Though Swift's representatives and the jet's operating company are yet to confirm that the 34-year-old megastar is using the plane, it is the same vessel that reportedly jetted Swift on her mad dash from Tokyo back to the United States in time to attend the Super Bowl. Swift flew back from Japan to Las Vegas with a stopover in Los Angeles in enough time to see boyfriend Travis Kels help the Chiefs to a 25-22 overtime win in Super Bowl 2024 on Sunday night. The two had a touching embrace on the field that was captured by inside the NFL. Thank you for making it halfway across the world. You're the best, baby. The absolute best. Kels told Swift as the two embraced amid the post-game madness at Allegiant Stadium. While fans may be disappointed, local officials may be breathing a sigh of relief. That's gonna be a whole second level of security issues that we have to deal with the crowds and all that sort of thing, city manager Brian Platt told KCUR of the potential of Swift being in attendance. So we are more than ready. We have no concerns with our safety protocols and what we're doing to make sure that the route will be free of any issues. Platt also hinted to the station that the city may have told Swift's team it would be best if she did not attend. I can't confirm or deny but we might have already told that to her team, just to keep everybody safe and make things a little bit easier for us, Platt said. Swift has three shows in Melbourne and four in Sydney before the tour heads to Singapore. Kels is expected to join Swift at some point on the tour.